Good morning, kids. Good morning. Hey, Self. Hey, Max. Max just had his bottle. What's up? And how are you guys? What is up and welcome to the vlog. I am now editing on my iPhone because my computer is being uh, repaired and I tried to use my old 11 year old MacBook and it wasn't happening. It'll work, but it takes forever. So actually I'm able to, uh, this, this camera that I'm using, the G7X Mark II, has Wi-Fi built in and it works so easily. So I transfer the clips over to my phone and then just edit and upload it from my phone. It's actually really nice. It doesn't beat the uh, original way of doing it on Final Cut Pro on my MacBook and I can make thumbnails on there. I'm not really making thumbnails. I'm kinda just using the ones that YouTube suggests, but. Just for a few days until I get my computer back. I cannot wait to get my computer back. But hopefully by the weekend, fingers are crossed. Please cross your fingers <laughs> as well. Um, a company sent us some stuff. I'm actually going to record a video today and another one another day. Um, so the two companies are B. They sent stuff from Max, so BB stuff. And then Little Woodsies, they sent some stuff for Sophia. So this is the Little Woodsy stuff. I'm going to obviously make a video on it, but they sent uh, a family. They sent a little set, picnic set, and then a little uh, sweets and treats truck. So that's cool. So he's excited about that. And then they sent three, like, baby toys. You've probably seen this brand in Target. I know I have. I definitely recognize this brand. B. B for baby, I guess. I don't know. But, uh, but yeah, I'm going to sit down once Sophia is at camp. I'm going to sit down with Max and um, probably open these beforehand. I usually open boxes like in the video, but I think I'll open it beforehand and uh, kind of show the three toys and make a little video on it. So hopefully you guys enjoy that one. Um, that's my plans for today. I'm still wearing my heart monitor. So uh, there's five of these all across my chest, and I realized this morning that this one was unstuck, and it was stuck on my belly some random spot when I woke up. I don't know how long it was like that, because obviously it happened during the middle of the night, so it could have been hours, I don't know. Hopefully that's not a problem. Hopefully they don't get this information back and they're like, uh, you gotta do this again, because that might happen, but hopefully not. I wear this until four o'clock, so basically right around the time where I uh, pick up Sophia from camp, and then uh, we're going to go straight to drop it off at my doctor's. They're closed, but they have a little box right outside the door that I'm just going to drop it in there. And that's it. Actually, it works out really perfectly, the timing, so I don't have to go out myself like later on in the day. But how are you, little girl? You ready for camp? Looks like a rainy day. My goodness. But once again, it's supposed to stop on like... A couple hours, I think, and it might rain again at like one ish, but then that's it. And then, like, tonight again, I don't know, it's just raining on and off all week basically. This kid keeps bouncing, bouncing, baby. Are you a bouncing baby? We gotta open your toys today, Max. Yeah, yeah, you excited, buddy? You excited, buddy? <laughs> Are those little toys that they sent? Mm -hmm. And then we got to do yours one day. Ooh, you excited about those too? Little woodsies. So they're like, they're kind of like Calico Critters, but it's a different brand. Um, I've seen those at Target too. They have those at Target, right? Little woodsies. So uh, Target brand stuff. That's cool. Is that cool, Max? Pretty close. Close his face, is that all right? I we'll lift it up. Maybe that's better, actually. There you go. What do you think, buddy? Pretty cool. Can you reach these? They spin. If this is well, this has to be further down for it to spin. There they go. Spin around, little baby. Grab it. Yeah, go. See, these are actual things. Yo yeah, yo. Yeah. I think he likes it. <laughs> All right, you kids, good. It's fun to but call him. Well, what? Max is the wet one. Yeah, I know. <laughs> He's soaking wet all the time with his between spit up and just drool in general. He's always wet. That's why he always wears a bib. Always got to keep a bib on him, otherwise his clothes would be soaked. So now at least just his bib is soaked. 
And it's closed a little bit too. Yeah, a little bit is closed too. <laughs> it goes through. There's so much spit. It must be contained. All right, I'm gonna go drop this kid off at camp and then head back home. So, um, usually I make something different for Sophia when I make, tonight I'm having the Jamelli pasta with chicken and broccoli. Usually I make something different, but I decided, let's, let's just skip the broccoli. She's not gonna do it. It's, it's not gonna work out. Um, but at least she can have chicken and pasta. And that's easy to do. Just don't put the broccoli in a little, put a little separate pot. I'm being quiet, quiet because Max is sleeping. So shush guys, shush. Do not wake him up. And pulled over because she gets dropped off in a window, and drop off is, is a 20 minute window. And usually I'm there like at the beginning of the window, but a little early today, so I just pull over like a block or two away and uh, just wait for the window. Just uh, four minutes, pulling over for four minutes, then we're gonna go and drop her off. You tired, Sylph? You look a little tired over there. What is up with that? You kind of went to bed a little bit late last night. I don't know if you knew that. I don't know if you realize because you don't really tell time, but... I, I didn't realize. Yeah, it was a little late. It was like... 9.30 or something like that. Usually she's in bed by 8. So yeah, late night girl. Well, I'll see you guys back at home. Alright, so I just got home and I unboxed all of those toys real quick here. About to make a video, wiped it down with some uh, pure and clean everything, you know, because everything's going to go in his mouth, and I don't know where these toys have been before this. All right, buddy, you ready to get out? It's like almost time to eat, but not quite yet. Perfect time to make a quick video. He's up, he just napped. It's like the perfect time to do this. Um, so at least maybe during next nap, I can edit the video and upload it and all that stuff. So, uh, yeah, I'm gonna get him out. We're gonna make this quick little video. You're gonna get some new cool toys. I saw you eyeing it when I was opening it up. Seems like you were a little bit interested, huh? You like this toy? It's pretty cool, right? Green triangle, orange circle, and a purple square with a mirror in it. Oh, look, there you guys are. Oh, there you guys are. Hi, guys. All right, little Mr. Man. Oh, you got a little dribble there. Taking him for a nap. Nap time for the man. Have a nice nap, buddy. See you later. All right, I fed Max. He's down for a nap, and I'm gonna use this time to edit the video that I just recorded with him with the toys on my phone, and then I'm gonna use the uh, computer uh, to make some thumbnails. It's gonna be annoying because everything is completely slow on that computer, but I'll do it now. Usually this is the time where I shower, but I can't do that. I can't shower till the evening because uh, I pick up Sophia at four and that's around the time where I take this heart monitor off. It's annoying because this thing is around my neck. It's a pouch that holds the electronic thing. And then I got the, the leads all over my chest, five of them. Um, but I can't shower with it, so that's why I have to wait until pretty much I get back from picking her up from camp, give her a shower, then it's like dinner time, then I can shower, so. By the way, guys, yeah. I never updated you guys on Chia Guy. We got a Chia pet, but it's a guy's face. Um, we did it on her birthday on July 6th. It is currently July 25th. So at 19 days, almost three weeks, this thing stinks. It didn't really work. I'll show you guys close up. Right, so here it is. All the ones on top are not sprouted at all. We got some sprouts, but like, uh, I wouldn't consider this successful at all. And I have been keeping this thing watered. You're supposed to keep this full of water. It leaks out of it, as you can see, because this is what it's made of. But uh, I kept that thing full. I got a spray bottle to spritz the top so the seeds were always wet. I took good care of that thing and it did not work. It was supposed to make my daughter happy and it didn't work. <laughs> no, but seriously, what's up with that? That's annoying. All right, I just put Max down for a nap. He's, I'm gonna have to wake him up 25 minutes into his nap because we gotta go. But I may be having a little bit of luck with this. I thought about this for a while and I haven't actually tried it until today. I did a couple feedings 
and they seem to be working. They're still, you know, a little troublesome, but it, it seems to help. So this is the setup here. I put him in this little bouncy chair right on the table here. And it's safe. It's fine because I'm sitting right there holding onto it, basically. I sit right here. He's in here, and I feed him. But here's the thing. I play Elmo. I play Elmo. It's called Music Magic. It's like an hour long, but they do a lot of singing, and he's very, very intrigued. I mean, he gets annoyed, like I say, and you gotta give him like a couple minute breaks here and there, but like he ate the last bottle in a half an hour, which is, it's really good, generally. I mean, his fastest is usually like 15 minutes, but half an hour is still pretty good considering sometimes it takes 45 minutes or an hour. So, I've been having a little bit of luck with that, and uh, I think I'll be doing it from now on. You know, it keeps him distracted while eating, and yeah, you know, it bounces up and down, so I kind of hold this so he doesn't bounce it. Um, maybe I need a little bit more on his back, so I pull it down a little bit as I feed him. It just, whatever works, guys, and it seems to be working. So, I'm gonna relax for 20 minutes, and then uh, change his diaper and go pick up Sophia from camp and take this heart monitor off and drop it off. I cannot wait to get this thing off of me. Oh, I cannot. Did I mention that one of these things fell off last night and I didn't know how long it was off for because it happened overnight. Could have been hours, could have been the entire night. It happened again before and I don't know how long it was. Couldn't have been that long because I, I know that one fell off. I keep checking it, but I went to go check and I was like, where is it? And it was down by my belly button. I'm like, dang it, dang it. But yeah, a little bit of relaxation, then I'm gonna go. All right guys, I am pulled over and uh, ready to take this thing off in eight minutes. I gotta wait here like 12 minutes before I leave to go get Sophia. Um, but eight minutes, I can take this thing off. This is what the thing looks like. It's just in this pouch. And then there's the strap that goes around my arm and neck. But yeah, that's it. It's just uh, It just says the time, the date, and the time remaining. Look at that, seven minutes, 42 seconds. And I could take this thing off. Oh, I cannot wait. It already feels way better taking that thing off, but I wanna get all these sticky things off my chest. Guys, I was expecting to take those off and it would hurt, but wow, did that hurt. You know, I'm a guy, I have chest hair. A couple of them were on. Ooh, it's so, it's so. Sore. I'm gonna show you. I'm gonna show you just because not my chest, but the a couple of these things. Look at this. Look at the pain that must have and I, I must have endured. Just look at that. Oh God. Wow, that was the worst part. And it's so sensitive now. Jeez Louise. Ah. Oh. Anyway, I'm gonna put this in the bag. Leave in a second. In one minute. Actually now to go get Sophia from the camp of, uh, like a couple blocks away and then head on over and drop it off at the doctor. But oof, I'm glad that's over. Ooh, ouch, it hurts, it hurts. It just waxed my chest. Welcome back, Super Dovers. Mm -hmm. Did you have fun at camp today? Mm -hmm. She has a good time, even though it rained. You still found things to do. They have a lot of indoor things. And uh, yeah, so we're home. I dropped off my heart monitor and uh, it's time for Max to eat right now. Liz should be home any minute and then I'm gonna cook some dinner. You hungry? Mm -hmm. She's always hungry. She's a growing girl. That was a hectic last hour. <laughs> we came home, it's around the time Liz got home and uh, I cooked dinner, Liz was feeding Max. And then we were eating dinner, Max decided to spit up and then he spit up pretty much over all over the entire house. Let me just clean this up. Um, it's really, really humid out. It keeps fogging up all over the house. So cleaning that up, cleaning him. Then we needed to give him a bath because it was bath time anyway for him. And Sophia also needed a shower because she went to camp today. And it was just like washing up from dishes after dinner. It was just like a hectic, hectic like hour, I think it was. Um, but I'm done. I'm running out. To the convenience store and uh, I'm gonna end the vlog here ah, it's so humid out sorry man for the sake of I know I know sometimes I, I make the vlogs like go into the next day but for the sake of when I don't have a computer and I'm editing on my phone it's way too hard to do that and judge how long the vlogs are and stuff like that 
Um, it's not the best way to edit, personally, I prefer on the computer. Um, so for the sake of this week, or until I get my computers back, they're just gonna be day-long vlogs, pretty much. So beginning of the day to the end of the day. So I'm ending the vlog here. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Sorry for the fog. I'll see you tomorrow. Have a great night.